Hey everyone, it's Wang Diva Makeup Queen. How are you? Welcome back to my channel and to my video. Today I'm going to talk about my top 10 most favorite skincare products. And you know, a lot of people, you guys come to me and say, oh, you have such nice skin and you know, your skin is flawless. Well, it's not really true. I do try to find foundation that works on my skin tone and also I really do try now as much as I can, I hope it's not too late, but to try to take care of my skin, you know, always using SPF when I go out like every day without exception. I always have some sort of SPF and then have a good um, evening and morning skincare regimen and I use the following 10 products a lot. I alternate but these are my most favorite. I really see results with these. So I'm going to recommend these 10 products for you. The first product I'm going to recommend to you is Purely Pleasures Oak Face Scrub. It may not be a product that you're familiar with, but definitely go online to go to purelypleasures.net and I this is literally one of my most favorite so much so that I've only used this much even though I received this a while back because I love it that much. It smells so good. It's completely natural. When I say completely natural, I don't mean like those companies that advertise natural and they put a bunch of crap in it. I mean natural. It has oatmeal in it and it has other natural ingredients they put in. It kind of smooths out your skin and afterwards you feel so smooth it doesn't dry you out. And most importantly, what I love about this is it smells divine and I mean divine it's like it smells so good that I want to eat it oh I love it I absolutely love it I think like it's only eight bucks so I I really highly recommend this it's it's so good next product that I use pretty regularly is uh, St. Ives is it St. Eve's or St. Ives I don't know apricot scrub renew and firm as you can see I'm almost finished with it um, I use it quite a lot. First of all, it's like a drugstore brand, like something that you can find in Rite Aid or Target. It doesn't dry out your skin. It does. It's not too harsh. I feel like it does a good job of face scrub. Now between these two, I must say I like this even better than this. But this is also a good option uh, because I've seen it for like three dollars or four dollars in drugstore, uh, and so I would recommend that you pick this one up too. Number three. Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Lotion. It's basically my everyday staple. This is the lotion that I put on after I shower and then I'm about to go out. And I just put that on. It's just not greasy. It's not too overly creamy. It's just right. And it moisturizes your skin so that it feels firm and it also feels uh, not dry. So, And also what's great about this, you can mix this with foundation if you want to let's say make it less thick and a little bit more sheer so I know that some gurus actually I think it was Xtiner who suggested that and I have started doing that and that's really excellent for that so this is also 100% fragrance free for those of you who are you know have, who have sensitive skin a vino positively radiant cleanser oil free soap free hypoallergenic this is wonderful again look at how much I have left like I don't know if you can tell I have this much left not much this I love for several reasons when you squeeze it out it looks really iridescent which I like I don't know why but uh, it just cleans your skin really well without over drying I'm all about not over drying my skin okay this does not over dry and does a good job and does not irritate my skin and that's why I like it so much so this is wonderful I use it um, either in the shower again I keep saying I use it in the shower I guess I use a lot of these products in the shower but I also use it sometimes uh, in the evening after I take off my makeup I apply this and cleanse and then um, that makes it cleaner ho oh, ho another Clinique one check out how much I've left zero <laughs> I almost never hit pan with any of my cosmetics but with skincare I do because I use it every day but this is the Clinique all about eyes reduces puffs circles and this is really good as you can see how I used it all up but um, it does help with puffs I don't have too much puffs thank thankfully oh my goodness I hope it keeps that way but I just has it just has this calming feeling it's very smooth when you apply you know because I don't like lotion that tucks you can just smooth it out so it feels nice and relaxed so I like this Murad uh, essential C daily renewal complex 
This stuff is incredible because I actually feel the difference because I often apply this um, well first of all you're supposed to apply it um, like um, after you clean your face and before you put your moisturizer on so this stuff it goes on so smooth and it makes it feel like almost like a um, primer on your face it has that primer feeling but it's just supposed to be vitamin C the next day I can feel that my skin is much more supple and soft so this is really good and I got this as a gift um, because I don't really venture so much into like high-end skincare or anything so um, I don't know how expensive it is but I think this is like a fancy brand but it really is that good I ain't gonna lie see this is why I love Hong Kong because you can try out all these skincare products at like Sasa or one of those shops and you can just get a trial size you pay I don't know how much like 10, 10 bucks maybe or less maybe like eight seven or eight bucks and you get a trial size and then you can decide whether you like it or not and then you buy the full size and this I love this is my second jar already this I put um, in the evening sometimes it smells so good and makes your skin so soft oh, it's like the best I mean there is something to high-end skincare I must say there's some good um, like drugstore brands but with high-end skincare I I really feel like for some I should um, use high-end because I do notice that for some it's better not all there's some really good drugstore ones too so if you happen to go to Asia or Hong Kong stop by Sasa one of those stores and pick one of these samples up it's really good I may have already mentioned this brand Atomy is a Korean brand um, and one of my favorites monthly favorites videos this is incredible one of my most favorite another stable every day um, actually I'm just counting this as like one product because the whole brand and the whole line is incredible Korean women they don't mess around when it comes to skincare they don't mess around they want the best and I think that this is really the best I heard that their products are also manufactured by um, Shiseido or rather they have the same manufacturer so very very high quality is really impressive this one is one of my favorite evening care foam cleansing you need about less than a pea size and it foams your whole skin and then it takes a long time to actually rinse off and I wonder if they do that on purpose so that you can really rid your skin of like any dirt and any sort of makeup because it will take everything off this is incredible along with the line that I actually also really love is their evening cream uh, and it's just it makes your skin really smooth and I can feel the difference the next day so I love love this line um, my aunt actually knows um, how to get in touch with the company and she can tell you a little bit more you can email her to find out more information about how to buy these products I don't even know if you can find this in America. Um, this is called Lorene. Um, I don't know where it is from, but I got this from Hong Kong and I love it because this is great for you to um, put on your neck. So as you can see, my neck is starting to be not as firm as I would like it to be. I'm getting old, you guys. I know we all get old, so we just have to take good care of ourselves. And you know, we often forget about the neck. The neck needs firming. The neck needs SPF and it needs cream as well. So this I put on and treat my neck every evening so that it still remains elastic. And firm. I recommend that um, you find something similar, something that's specifically for your neck and is firming. And start young. Don't think that because you're um, 21 you don't have to worry about your skincare. No, you gotta worry. I'm telling you. Not worry, but you gotta take good care because that will prevent you from wrinkling, you know, by the time you're like my age. You know what I mean? Okay. <laughs> the last product that I really like is Lancome's. Comforting creamy foaming cleanser and it's supposed to be for dry skin, but it works really well for me because What I usually have problems with with cleansers is after you finish you feel like All the water and moisture is sucked out of your skin This does not do that. This 
makes you I mean they all make you a little bit dry but it does not make you feel terribly dry so even though I have combo to oily skin this still works for me it's non irritant and it takes off makeup super well I need something that really takes off every single little dirt and every single little um, makeup eyeliner whatever really well and this does the job so even though this might be a little bit pricey for some of us I feel like it's well worth the money so those are my top 10 products. I hope this is helpful to you. And please do let me know what are your favorite skincare products. If there's some that you can recommend to me and to others, please write below. I would love to hear from you. And I can't wait to hang out with you guys on Twitter and Facebook. And also my blog. Don't forget to follow me. And don't forget to like and favorite. And also subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. And I look forward to seeing you again. Bye!